And it's against that backdrop that school districts are starting or getting ready to start new school years this month. And Governor Tate Reeves has already said he has no intention of mandating masks in schools. That means the decision is falling to local districts. Our 12 News Tata has live information for us in Rankin County where she spoke with one teacher about what he wants to see in place this school year. Tao? Well, mask guidelines are dividing school districts as we head into the new school year, Walt, um, as educators have yet to decide whether masks should be optional or mandatory. The start of school and once again the threat of COVID-19 hangs in the air. This year it's the Delta variant that has many concerned. It's already, you know, I feel like it's eerily similar to how we were last year. Max Van Landingham is a teacher in the Rankin County School District where masks remain optional. But should it be left up to districts to implement their own masking policies? The teacher who spent almost a decade at Northwest Rankin High says it should be left to the governor. I don't trust these kids. I don't trust these kids and I don't trust these parents to do the right thing when it comes to the mask. A statement from the Mississippi Association of Educators, President Erica Jones reads in part, Mississippi's new daily COVID infections are continuing to rise at an alarming pace. How bad will it have to get before the health and safety of students and educators is prioritized over the politics of the moment? Some area districts have already changed course on masking policies just a week into the school year after reported COVID outbreaks. Last year, I had kids who got sick at school and then took COVID home and their parents died from it. Students at Northwest Rankin High School returned to school on Friday. I feel like if schools try to implement it themselves, then um, parents are going to, you know, be up in arms about it because they're the ones that have the biggest problem with with wearing masks. It's actually not their not their students. Yeah, their students hate it, but they'll listen to, you know, teachers. State leaders and public health officials have sounded the alarm on requiring masks in schools. And the Mississippi Department of Education says local school boards ultimately have the authority uh, to pass policies for their school districts and that the MDE nor the state superintendent have the authority to override local school board policies, adding that the state superintendent advises uh, school districts to follow guidelines from the CDC and the Mississippi Department of Health. Live at Rickey County School District, Tal Tal